honorable member of the parliament. Mr. Jacob K. Jacob Chachwaran, Mr. Nebu M. Babu, Youth Secretary, Mr. Philip Jacob, Youth Vice President, Mr. Nebu Lukos Pandina, and Youth Representative, Mr. Joyce Sawar, Joint Joy Pandina. On this prestigious occasion, it is our proud privilege and fortune to welcome Dr. Salsam Kamal, Honorable Member of Parliament, as Chief Guest of the Grand Finale. Now, we are immensely honored by your gracious presence. Honorable dignitaries and my dear parishioners, a hearty welcome to one and all. Before we begin, let us have a word of prayer. May we call upon Mr. Vijay Joseph for the opening prayer. സ്വാത്രം <laughs> അവിടുത്തെ സാന്നിധ്യവും കരുതലും ഉണ്ടായിരിക്കും മാറാമോ എന്ന് പ്രാർത്ഥിക്കുന്നു മറ്റു തിരക്കരങ്ങളിലേക്ക് ഏൽപ്പിച്ച് പ്രാർത്ഥിക്കുന്നു ഞാൻ കൊണ്ടി ജീവൻ Our Honorable Chief Guest, Dr. Sultan Mohammed Abdul Hakim Kamal, Youth Secretary Nemoil Papu, Vice President David Jacob, Church Warden Jacob Jacob A. Jacob. I give to you all in the name of our Lord Jesus. Let me take this precious moment to thank our Heavenly Father for the wonderful love and opportunity he had to us celebrate the grand finale of Youth Service League Canada. We have planned and prayed for the occasion. And finally, it is here with us. The Church of South India is the second largest Christian church in India. The Church of South India is the United Fellowship of World Wealth Churches, an Anglican, and the Presbyterians, and the Methodists, and the Congregation Church in India. Our parish history. During 1978, the Malayan Christian residents in Dharak for the name Burn Malayan Christian Congregation. In 1978, Reverend E.V. Eppen arrived to take charge of the first priest. In the modern, innovative, and progressive kingdom of Berlin, religious freedom is enjoyed by all faith, which worship without interest and without fear. This freedom is so specially born in the, in the region and expectations. We are very grateful for your Maj- majestic gift and the financial and the are the court prints, are the old officials in Bahrain. That since we have in the commitment of the of this freedom, the CSA Madagara Dayan Youth Movement was the first Christian church movement in Asia. The aim of movement was to invite the youth, serve the church, and thus lead them to the birth of dedication and the community. Nowadays, youth movement organizes well, various programs such as students' conference, teenage programs, Education programs, youth week and youth Sunday, writing competition, Bible teachers, and etc. Here in Balan Malayalam, Balayalam Parish Youth Movement was started in 1998 under the guidance and leadership of Vidar Ravan Chanti Thomas Hatcher. It was a glittering page in the history of Balan. Being an important organization of parish, the youth movement organized various programs in this year. We also conducted various programs such as Youth Week as a part of the organization, organized Youth Friday, Youth Musical Night. For Youth Retreat, we invited the Rav Shibu PHN as a speaker. He is presented the theme, the discipline. Then we organized a class in ecology and practical life. The class is about vegetable production in a race bed. And deeper irrigation technology. The concept was 
in the concept of an IoT for, for us, use a limited area in a more productive manner. We were happy to introduce youth calendar in Bern, Malayali Parish, to develop and show new guys goal given talents for the glory of show. This is one of the first ventures in the history of Bern. The different competitions were conducted in different categories such as sub junior, junior, and series. It has been a long journey, but let me thank Lord for the making the possible for here today. For because of youth movement, I would like to take opportunity to, to welcome to the honorable dignitaries of the year. First of all, I'd like to welcome our actually James of the day. The vigor and the pursuit of youth movement. I think that's been an expression and has a support for us all the way to this moment. I think we are really grateful, grateful to you for this, for this occasion. It is my honor and enormous pleasure to introduce our chief guest, Dr. Susan Gamal, the distinguished parliamentary member of Berlin. She is an active member of health committee at the Berlin Chamber and mentor of UN, UN IDO, IDO counseling team. And she is also a member of the International Peace Ambassador Academy and the National Society for Support, Education and Training. And moreover, she is worked with the Psychiatric was the world for 18 years since 1997. She is elected as a parliamentary member in the year of 2018. It was a historic victory of human in the world election. It calculates the great order. Welcome to our chief guest, Susan Kamal. Now, I welcome to Nebu and Babu, the Secretary of Youth Movement. The Philip Jacob, Vice President of Youth Movement. Next, I would like to welcome Mr. Jacob Jacob, Jacob K. Jacob, Church Warden of Berlin CSI Parish. Then, I welcome to the member of Church Committee for the Old Parishioners. Finally, I have huge thank to everyone who participated in the competition and welcome to all these all this for the event. Once again, once again, I thank you for all listening to me and may our loving Lord here with us for us. Thank you. Thank you for the presidential address. May we welcome our vicar, Reverend James Joseph, for the presidential address. First President Dr. Sarsan Mohammed Abdul Rahim Kamal, Member of Parliament, guests and members of the Bahrain Sikhsi Malayali Parish. It is my privilege to preside the grand finale of Sarkas Murphy, a cultural event organized by the youth movement of the Bahrain Malayali Sikhsi Parish. Sargas Mudi is a cultural event conceptualized to promote the insights and talents of the church members irrespective of their age. The youth movement of this parish is being actively involved in various social and religious activities for the past 20 years. The members of the movement always emphasize on service as an epitome of God's love towards humankind, like supporting who are sick or in need. Besides conducting social and religious events, the movement commenced an event from 2018 that initiates an eco-friendly agricultural drive among the parishioners. We all know that the, the rulers and the people of the Kingdom of Bahrain greatly emphasize on religious harmony and religious freedom. On behalf of the parish, I express our sincere gratitude to Dr. Sausan Kamal, 
for blessing this occasion with your gracious presence. May the Almighty God bless and strengthen her to continue all her endures. Thank you. Nenpara. Nenpara was a traditional paddling mushroom unit used in Kerala households. But be it in temples, homes, weddings, or anything else, it is one sight you are sure to witness in, in Kerala. It symbolizes prosperity, traditional beauty, and a long lost cultural legacy. I would like to request our honorable chief guest, Dr. Sarsan Kamar, to accept a Nenpara memento as a token of our gratitude and appreciation. the lightning ceremony. May I call upon the dignitaries on the dice for the symbolic lightning ceremony. First of all, I would like to welcome Chief Guest Dr. Swasan Kamal to lightning the lab. fountain of boundless energy unleashed. It is said, you are only young once, and if you work it right, once is enough. Everyone has aspirations, hopes, and dreams to be realized to go top of the world. In fact, all of us play one of the most important roles in this community and society development. You are not only the leaders of tomorrow, but also the partners of today and are social actors of change and progress. It is you that are a crucial segment of development. Your contribution, therefore, is highly needed. The bubbling enthusiasm which has to be regulated and utilized in the right way. After all, all the people can only exercise their full potential when they are young and energetic. You are considered the pillars of development. Youth are the basis of the civilized, civilized development of all countries in the world. They are the energy that is capable of production, access to the highest levels of social progress, and the integrated and growing organizations. 
If we embrace the young people of the homeland, we put them on the right path. But the constraints that they do not find acceptance of the other groups that precede them in age or experience because there is perhaps a gap in which all parties believe that it is more correct and that it is more appropriate. We should create the principles to change concepts and make good contributions for all, structural integration to the satisfaction of all. The youth at Bahrain represent the largest number, the majority, and if we draw with them development plans and gave them opportunities, it will be satisfactory for leadership and youth altogether. At the end, I thank from my heart every official in this country and in this organization and all the members and attendees standing and appointing young people who have the skill, thought, and science and bring them out of the lights so that they can be a source of enlightenment, civilization, and creativity. Thank you all. Thank you, Ma. Next, we have the felicitation speech. We will request Mr. Jacob Ray Jacob, Charles Warren, to deliver the felicitation speech. Praise the Lord. Respect of God, Reverend James Joseph, our honorable guest, Dr. Southern Kamar. Member of the Berlin Parliament, all the church committee members, and our loving parishioners. A warm regards to all, all of them, in the name of our precious Lord Jesus Christ. Today, it is a great pleasure to be here since our youth movement have conducted a caramela in a professional manner, which was concluded here to, with the, today's finale. First of all, we, on behalf of church committee, we congratulate our parish priest, our, our youth convener, Libu Luko, and all the office players of the youth moment on, for this achievement. Secondly, we acknowledge the presence of our honorable class, Dr. Southern Kama, which is an honor and privilege and for our church. She is a very well-known social worker and a consultant of psychiatrists who aims to empower others by raising the self-awareness and living in the moment. She is also one of the pillars of the democratic process of battery. We wish you success in your personal profession and at the same time for your activity, social activities. My responsibility of this function is to convey the specific discussion on behalf of church committee. Kerala spiritual and philosopher leader, Lake Chimayananda, once said, You are not careless, they are careless. Can I repeat? You are not careless, they are careless. The Bible says, Psalms 1 to 27 verse 4. Like arrows in the hands of a warrior are the sons born one born in one suit. Blessed is the man who is pure in full of love. When we read in the different manner, when a church or society utilizes their youth in the proper way, then progress will be achieved. Bible also urges to remember our Creator while we are young. This should be the ultimate aim of our youth moment. So, keeping that in mind, we wish you success in all your future activities, hoping you reach each and every youth in this island. May God bless you all. Thank you. Thank you. Next, we have the word of thanks. I request Mr. John Mon George to deliver the word of thanks. Has been highly privileged to today by your esteemed presence. 
On behalf of myself, as well as our youth movement, I would like to wish you all the success in you, your future endeavors. May God Almighty bless you today, tomorrow, and always to do your best to this tiny island of Paris. Thank you.
Thank you.